Okay, so here's this illuminator. It has 48 LEDs. They are black LEDs because the light emitted by them it is invisible. It's infrared at 940 nanometers. Okay, and you can power it through that one. It is using 12 volts DC. For that we have this small little cable and just plug that in there and plus is the red and black is the negative okay we have another one but you don't really need it in this case it has a light sensor there a photodiode and if you cover it then no light will enter into the sensor and thus the LEDs will light up okay and if it has enough light from outside then it will turn off the LEDs. So basically it's turning on at night and turning off at daytime. Okay, and here's a, an action camera, it's an SG4000. And if you remove this cover from the lens, just simply pull it out. Then you can actually place this one there, like so. Of course the pins won't allow to go down, but it is okay. So you can use it as a night camera, especially if you remove the infrared filter from the lens, which is removed from this one. Okay, so let's just try it. I'm going to use an adapter. Let's switch it to 12 volts DC and plug it in. And here's the output. The smaller one is the positive and the larger one is the negative. Negative there positive there okay and since we have enough light the lamp is not turning off so let's cover the sensor and voila the light is not very powerful because this camera has its infrared sensor that one is not removed so as we can see at night time when there is no light it turns on and when it receives light that sensor then it turns off Okay, and let's see with this one. Let's power it on and let's take a look at the monitor. This one sees the light much better. The screen even dims because of that light. So I'm covering and uncovering the sensor. As you can see, it is dimming seriously that LCD. So the light is pretty powerful. Of course the other camera, the larger one, this one is not recording the infrared light as well as this one. You have to unscrew the lens, remove that infrared filter and then it will see much better the infrared light. Okay, so that's a small infrared illuminator. 940 nanometers is the wavelength of the emitted light, which is completely invisible at night time. So let's just test it. Just made a little bit of shadow here. But this light is totally invisible to my naked eyes. But of course you can see it on the camera. It's on even with a little bit of shade. And if the light is less, then it turns on. I'm creating a little bit more shadow with my finger. And the lamp turns on even more even with my hand a little bit more shadow more light okay that's it thanks for watching and bye bye